Hello guys and welcome back to sustainability at home. Now, let's start with washing our hands. Very important. And you know why. There's a lot of germs and viruses going around at the moment. And if we wash our hands with soap and water, we get rid of those. But I'll let you into a secret. Not all germs are bad germs. There's some, some that are really important for us. They keep us healthy and they create beautiful food. Yeah, you heard right. If we have the right germs under the right conditions, we can make food with them. I show you how. First, I want to show you a few foods that you already know that are created with these good germs that occur naturally everywhere. So we have chocolate, we have yogurt, cheese, uh, we have butter, even coffee and tea, kombucha, kimchi, and one of my personal favorites, pickles. Beautiful sour pickles, really good. Now, these little germs are living on the surface of pretty much everything, your hands, vegetables, but the trick is, just like with your Mini Beast Hotel, to create the right welcoming environment, a good habitat for the good germs to thrive and helps you to turn a fresh cucumber into a beautiful pickle. Now, how is this done? Well, it's really simple. You'll be surprised. All you need is a jar. Um, you want to put a few things in here to give it flavor. we come to that in a second. But the right environment is really nothing more than a bit of salty water. Okay, so it has to be the right amount of salt. Give and take, if you have about one liter of water, of water in here, you'll need 50 grams of salt for that. Okay, one liter to 50 grams. Okay, wonderful. That gives you a five percent salt solution, a brine. Okay, so very, very simple. So let's start. First, I like my pickles with a bit of dill. So, dill goes in. If you have, put a bay leaf. Okay, they grow in our school garden. You probably know where. Um, chili, oh, if you like it. I think chili is good. Bit of garlic. Yep, a little clove of garlic. Um, if you have some peppercorns, why not? You don't have to be precise here, that's the beauty. Only the salt water is the important part. Now, first we need to lay out our little cucumbers. These are fresh. And another really cool thing is that when we do this with the microorganisms, turn this from a cucumber into a pickle, they will last a lot longer. They will be staying fresh all winter. Our summer produce is preserved. Now, three, let's see how many I can fit. Four, five, six. Ooh, it's a nice pickle jar. Seven, eight, maybe one more. Six, nine. All right, that just fits. Now I gotta make sure that the pickles are submerged. So first, water, about a litre for this size jar. So that is about a litre. I just want to submerge them. Now the salt. Really important. All the bad germs won't like the salt, but the good germs, they'll love it. So 50 grams is about three tablespoons. Now this will dissolve and make it a salty brine liquid. You don't need to do much for that. It'll just happen by itself over time. You can shake it a little bit. Now what is really important? That these pickles don't float to the top. Okay, naturally when these mini bugs, these mini beasts, these mini microorganisms start to do their work, these pickles will change from a cucumber into a pickle. They look a bit different, they're more translucent inside and they will start floating to the top. Okay, so in order to have them really nice and down under the liquid, we can use a little trick. We have a ziplock back here. You want to push that in. You 
push that in that's basically the lid you want to put some water inside of that so this makes a lid for your jar where a bit of gas can escape from the microorganisms they will breathe out a gas and that can escape whilst the pickles are pushed down under the surface of this liquid well that's pretty much it this is going to be beautiful pickles in about 10 days so you got to come back in like five days and then try them maybe because well you'll see that they change but you also have to mmm right that's just like a warhead super sour and crunchy you got to taste them okay so I challenge you to make another mini beast to tell with good germs and create pickles out of fresh cucumbers um yeah I think that's it so please close your laptops and start making pickles good luck can't wait for the results